Tony Hillerman Library is really in the middle of a neighborhood. It's surrounded by homes. But earlier this month, police say two people plotted against an elderly man right outside of this library to steal his car. Well, we take a walk around the library every day. Every afternoon, you'll find Connie Fletcher just outside Tony Hillerman Library. But now she's not so sure she'll keep her daily routine. Oh my gosh, yeah. I had no clue, yeah. no clue. Earlier this month, APD says these two followed a 75-year-old man leaving the library. Investigators say Donald David Condelaria walked up to the victim and punched him in the face. Meanwhile, Charissa Worthington moved in to grab the man's keys and they both took off. Those who used this neighborhood gathering spot shocked to hear this peaceful spot was a scene of an alleged violent carjacking. Would you assume being around a library or coming out of a library, you're safe? I assumed I was, honestly. Now this kind of freaks me out. APD says when you're coming out of a library, a business, maybe even your home, just take a moment to scan the area around you. Watch to see who's watching you. If someone's watching you, they're, they're watching for a reason. If you see someone shady, go back inside and call police or have someone walk you to your car. And this may not be a surprise to many of you. These two have criminal records. Now, as for Worthington, police say that she went into the library right before this alleged carjacking and got a library card. They also say inside the stolen car, they found a birth certificate and a social security card also with Worthington's name on both of those things. But so far right now, Worthington is just a suspect. That's according to APD. They're doing some more investigating to formally charge her in this case. Reporting for you live tonight, I'm Royal Day, KOAT, Action 7 News.